New video has emerged of a deadly car bombing deep in Russian-occupied territory. This as fighting continues near Ukraine's largest nuclear power plant, raising fears of a radiation emergency. Families are rushing to flee the area. ABC's Britt Clennett on the ground in Ukraine again for us tonight. Tonight, horrific new images showing a deadly car bombing in eastern Ukraine. Video circulating online shows the vehicle exploding in Russian-occupied Starobilsk earlier this month. Kyiv saying a former Ukrainian official who joined the Russian-backed forces in the region was killed. It's unclear who is responsible. This attack coming one week before the deadly car bombing outside Moscow that killed the daughter of a Putin ally. Ukraine denies responsibility. This is fighting intensifies around the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant. Russia tonight blocking a UN treaty that aims to prevent the spread of nuclear weapons, citing concerns over the military activities at the plant. Ukraine says Russia is using the plant as a military base. This situation created by Russians who, uh, who turned the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant, civilian nuclear power plant, into the military object, military base for them. Residents living nearby desperately trying to evacuate. This is what you see every night here at the evacuation center in Zaporizhia. Columns of cars coming in from the occupied areas. This family of four telling me it took five days to cross the checkpoint. Have you left any, any family behind? No. Antonina, fighting back tears, says she left her parents behind. I'm so sorry. It must have been incredibly hard. Antonina escaping with her husband and two children, describing the terror of living under Russian occupation, saying they could shoot at any moment. All it takes is a bad mood. And we're at this evacuation centre here in Zaporizhia. I just spoke to a maintenance worker at the plant. He said the atmosphere there is very tense. He's extremely worried about the safety because he says that Russian soldiers are using it as a military garage to store their vehicles. He described the plant as the biggest leverage Russia has in this war. Wit. An area still on high alert. Brick Clinic for us. Thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel and don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.